And then it happens on WECL. Got your tickets to win here in just a second for Larry the Cable Guy and a bunch of other stuff's going on this weekend. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hang tight for that. Uh, speaking of stuff going on this weekend, 38th Annual Flower Town Festival. Big time in Somerville, man. Do you know, i tell you how big this is, and a lot of folks assume the biggest thing going on in town this weekend is the Cooper River Bridge Run, or, or whatever they call it now. Is it, they still it's call still it Cooper River yes. Bridge Run, yeah. Um, but it's not. Uh, that I mean, that'll do 38,000 people registered, plus another 10 or so just jumping in. So you're looking at about 50,000 people involved yep. in, in the run itself, plus all the folks downtown who are putting it on and making yeah. it happen, and mm-hmm. and the vendors. Now, so you're looking probably, let's just say... 100,000 people. Okay. It's about half the size of the Somerville Flower Town Festival. They estimate uh, about a quarter of a million people wandering through there in three days. Yeah, that's huge. That's the biggest thing to happen in Somerville. Uh, One of the top 20 events to happen on an annual basis in the southeast United States, according to the uh, Southeast Tourism Society. people come in from, from all across the country to this thing. This thing is massive. Um, Somerville YMCA, uh, the sponsor of this thing, and uh, they said this year they've got 200 jury-selected artists who will be there in the park. Uh, they'll also have the taste of the town mm-hmm. uh, food area, some great food for you over there, all kinds of stuff for the kids to do. Do you have a booth set up this year for your art? For, no, I'm... Mm. You know, you could have done that. Well, it says it's juried. That means they have to look at it and decide whether well, it's yeah, worthy. But, but I, but I bet you, if you had to put yours in there for, if you submitted your artwork, I guarantee you, you would have made it. You're a celebrity and mm-hmm. art, and an artist too. Well, You've been in front mm-hmm. of a jury before too, haven't you? Yeah. So I mean, it would that, that doesn't make me nervous. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's just I hate to you know have them waste their time looking at stuff I know they're not going to let me oh, sell. No. So. They do good no, stuff. No. Maybe next year. Okay. Maybe next I year. I think you should. Maybe next year I'll have enough stuff in there to, to, I think you should. to put out there. I'd buy something. Uh huh. What kind of money are you charging for your stuff? Well, it depends on who I'm selling it to. Well, you see, give I, Gary discount? I get a deal. Yeah, Gary, Gary gets get, a deal. I get the what man, would it cost man me wife deal? to. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, but the hours, it, it starts Friday, 9 to 5. That's when a whole bunch of locals head that way. In fact, a lot of people take the day off from work. Well, like uh, Gary. Gary Griffin will not <laughs> uh, well, be here on Friday. He'll be at the uh, Flower Darlene Town Festival. and I, we're going to get up early, we're going to have coffee, we're going to go to breakfast, and we're going straight to Flower Town. We can't wait. 9 to 5 Friday, 9 to 5 Saturday, 9 to 4 Sunday. Yeah. Uh, it's really good. And they've already had the run. Now, Darlene was in the Flower Town yeah. run, wasn't yeah, she? Yeah, a couple of weeks ago they had the run. She won. She got a big old trophy for her age group. 26 minutes and a few seconds. Mm. What? Okay. I think that's wonderful. I'm that very is. proud of her. Yeah, that's good. I mean, she's how many people were in 59 her age years group? old. So it was her and how many other people? 10, 12 bunch. other people? Yeah, there's a bunch oh, of people bunch in that age group. Yeah. Somerville. Or it's Somerville. It's not, this is not was this Ed group. holding the other ones back? No, Ed. While she, <laughs> with his arms outreached. He tied rope around her legs. <laughs> that's right. He tied their shoelaces together. <laughs> So the uh, and that was what a five k or a ten k? That was a five five k. So she did that in, in twenty six minutes. Mm-hmm. Good for her. Do you guys ever buy anything when you go there? I mean, do you buy oh, some yeah. of the crafts? Oh Lord, yeah, we, yeah. We always take some some money and buy some stuff. We we have our house decorated with a lot of stuff. That we Their bought. house is a tribute to the Somerville Flower, Flower Town Festival. Festival. Yeah. Bird houses. We bought a few of those. Uh, do you have uh, that? The bear with the guy cuts with a chainsaw. No, you have I one never. Of those? I, no, Darlene's never let me get one of those. Wouldn't you like to have one though? That'd look real good out sure. in the front yard. Sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> one of those black bears. We, we always get some kettle corn. Yeah. That, we always we always go down and uh, get a corn dog. Partake in the taste of Somerville, some mm-hmm. of the finer restaurants there, Oscars included. And that that list is growing. Yeah. There are a lot of great yeah, restaurants in Somerville now. It's really a lot of Used fun. Used to it's be Oscars restaurant. and Hardee's. Mm. That was part of the taste of pretty it. much it. <laughs> Somerville and Alex's if they weren't too busy. That's right. Yeah. But now they have added some. Oh, uh, SomervilleYMCA dot org is the website to go to. SomervilleYMCA dot org, uh, and then click on Flower Town. Or if you're on Facebook, they also have a Facebook page. You can go get the information there as well. And we'll be up there on Saturday too, looking yep. for you. So come on, it's just a huge event. The uh, 38th annual Flower Town Festival it's in Somerville. Be a lot of fun. This weekend. Get ready, Papa's getting a new house in 